What's up, beautiful? How are you doing today? I hope that you're great. I am sick as a mother, but that's okay. Here we are. We're here to talk about da 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 the Urban Decay Stay Naked Weightless Foundation up to 24 hours of wear because who the fuck is wearing foundation for 24 hours? Not this girl. Jade41NN. Here's what the bottle looks like. She's pretty cool. There's flies in here. Why wouldn't there be? Because... Oh, no. Okay. Thought I got him. No, I didn't. Okay. Anyways, let's get into the tutorial. In the tutorial, I do my full makeup routine besides the eyes, so you will see all the products that I use in there. Please check out the description box, and also subscribe to my Instagram, because I'd love to have you. It's Katzen89. Come on over. You like me, I'll like you. How about that? It's, I sound creepy every time. Anyways, guys, if you're new here, please subscribe. I'd love to have you on my channel where it's just super lighthearted. Try to make you laugh a little, and I might look silly sometimes. And you know what? I'm okay with that. So let's get into the tutorial, and then we'll have a little chat about this foundation after... Okay, I'm right close to you, mate. I fucking love this foundation. My skin looks incredible. It is a perfect color match for me. I haven't been fake tanning <laughs> because I'm tired at the end of the day and uh, I'm over it. I love being tanned and glowy, but it's also fall time and uh, no. But anyways, I bought three different foundations at the same time because I'm crazy. I bought the Milk Foundation, I bought the Fenty Beauty Foundation that I've already uploaded, and this one is the best out of them all. I'm just going to tell you that right now. I still really love my NYX Stay Matte But Not Flat Foundation, but this is a hard second. Like, so close. I don't know what it, I can't tell you what I like more. I just fucking love that one more. Okay. Okay. I absolutely recommend this one. I know that there were a couple of reviews that weren't super great about it. I, I disagree with all. I don't have any cakiness at all. I don't find like any weird patchiness or anything. It's, it's, I look airbrushed to me anyways. Hmm? Mm-hmm. I literally don't have a single bad thing to say about this. It was a bit expensive. I think it was about $50, but all the other foundations are about the same amount. I absolutely recommend this foundation to you, mates. Please comment down below if there's a foundation that you would like me to try and that you think that I would like. 
I still have a shit ton of foundations that are on the way to my house to try out for you. So we'll see. Is there a better one than this one? Oh, I don't know. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will check you on the next one. Bye. You're the best. Well, second best. And I love you. Love, love.